Hey guys, Akil Mohideen here, and in this video I will show you how to change the aperture on most to any Canon DSLRs. So the first thing is that you're going to want to turn your camera on, and then navigate to manual mode via the wheel on top. In this mode you can change every aspect about the shot to make it appear exactly as you wish. The way you change the aperture is by holding down this button AV, which stands for aperture value, and then using your set wheel, which looks like this, to turn it and set the value. As you turn the wheel to the right, the aperture value gets larger and the physical aperture, which is a hole inside the lens that changes size, gets smaller. As you turn the wheel to the left, the value gets smaller and the hole gets larger. I know that sounds backward, but it actually is just like that. Now when the hole gets smaller, that means that less light is getting into the camera and that there isn't as much distinction between the subject and the background. Because the hole is getting smaller, less light is hitting the camera sensor and that means therefore that the shot will be darker than say if you had the aperture value small and therefore the hole large. Let me show you an example. Here's a shot that I took on f22, which is a small hole. Now here's the same shot that I took with every other setting the same except for the aperture, which is 3.5. See the difference between the brightness of the photos? Now I'll take the same shot but I'll optimize the lighting in each photo by changing the ISO and the shutter speed. If I do this I can get the lighting in each photo relatively equal. The difference here though is that the f3.5 shot, the monitor and the rest of the background is much more out of focus than in the f22 shot. So now you know the key aspects of your camera's aperture and you know how to change it. So thank you for watching this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.